It's crazy. I traveled since three years already. I don't really realize what this travel teach me. I left on a whim. I just wanted to put some spices in my life. I remember very well how I was excited at the beginning. I was amazed by everything. Today it became a routine. I look at the sets. I'm almost jaded. Because the feeling I had of discovering new things disappeared. <laughs> it's crazy, no? I complain about how lucky I am. I fall in love. I had really crazy moments. I lost 10 kilo in one night. I discover a lot of different faces of the world and of myself. This is like something traditional that Estonians do. I make a lot of friends. But we got separated by the travel. I felt lonely. I felt a kind of freedom in me. I laugh, I cry, I get in trouble. I asked myself some questions. And I could answer some of them. We take care of uh, the environment because we think about the new generation, we think about the other people. Only travel can give that. Mm. It's like an awakened dream that tell life is a gift and we should take care of it. I still didn't find what I was looking for, but I continue for what I believe doing what makes me happy and doing everything to share this happiness around me. But now I needed a break. I stayed six months in Brussels to come down before to finish this dream I began. I just want to live from what I enjoy to do, directing documentaries and working on collaboration projects. a des origines françaises, suisses et britanniques. C'est peut-être pour ça qu'il parcourt la planète, pour récolter des images et faire des documentaires qui racontent les gens avec un grand G. Kevin Ramley, un idéaliste engagé qui fait du cinéma communautaire et indépendant, Now I just want to get some distance from what I lived and what I want to live in the future. <laughs> it's just about taking the time, breathing, 
and I just want to enjoy the luck I have. Let's see what the future will give me.